guys, it's Taylor. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I am here to bring you a video that I have been in the mood to film for a while, but I wanted to wait until I got some stuff reorganized and all that jazzy fun stuff with my bookshelves. So I'm going to bring you a, I guess it's more of, it's not exactly a tag or anything like that, but it's more of a books by authors I own but haven't read, or I think this is more along the lines of series that I have started but haven't finished but I plan on finishing. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into video and show you the series that I have started but yet to finish that I would like to finish I think sometime before the end of the year. So the first book that I have read but haven't finished the series is going to be Throne of Glass by Sarah J Maas. I have the entire series including the novellas. Um, but yeah, I've only read Throne of Glass, and I do remember thoroughly enjoying it, but I think it's one of those things where I have to reread the series in order to really immerse myself once again, because I know that once I reread this, I'm just going to marathon the series. And yeah, I am super stoked about it, because I, like I said, I remember absolutely loving it this book. The next series is going to be the Daughter of Smoke and Bone series. Now this is the second book. My, I'm letting my best friend borrow the first one to see if she would like it. But yeah, this is the second book in the Daughter of Smoke and Bone series. I own one, two, and three. So yeah, I'm ready to dive in and complete this trilogy because I flew through Daughter of Smoke and Bone and it was just a fantastic, fantastic read. I thoroughly, thoroughly thoroughly enjoyed it and it's one of my most recommended books that I have given to people because if you like anything angels demons chimera all kinds of stuff going on and it's it's amazing it is fantastic the next series is going to be the all souls trilogy and this is by Deborah Harkness I have read a discovery of witches it was one of my favorites I own the second book and that is shadow of night and I am currently reading it, well, I'm in the middle of trying to read it and get it finished because I'm participating in the Duodecathon, and my challenge was a book that involves travel, and the two main characters travel back in time, they travel. So yeah, this is the second book. The third book is Book of Life, and I am on the hunt for that one because I feel like I'm going to be finishing this one by the end of the month, and I'm going to need that because, like I said, I'm wanting to finish this trilogy. The fourth series is the Land of Stories series by Chris Colfer and I absolutely love this. It is a middle grade fairy tale retelling kind of deal. Um, Chris Colfer, he is very influenced by the Grimm brothers as also heavily influenced by Hans Christian Andersen. So yeah, it's very, very good. It's a fast read. Um, I have read the first book which is The Wishing Spell. I have also read the Enchantress Returns. I have the next three in the series. Um, I don't know. I'm not really sure how many he's planning on writing, but I do have all that have been released. So the next series is Percy Jackson and the Olympians. I have read um, The Lightning Thief. I have also seen the movie. I have also seen the movie for Sea of Monsters. And I do remember really really liking them and I really do like the book. So I am still on the hunt for the fifth and final book in the Percy Jackson the Olympian series. I am looking for the last Olympian. So I think as soon as I find that book I will dive in and binge read this series. I really want to read the Heroes of Olympus series so I can get to I know the Trials of Apollo series is coming out with its second book and the, like these three series are very intertwined. I really want to get finished with Percy Jackson and the Olympian series so I can dive into the rest of Rick Riordan's work with them. The next series is going to be the Fallen Kingdom series by Morgan Rhodes. I just recently read this one last year and oh my god if this was not one of the best young adult high fantasy books that I have ever read then I don't know what will ever come close to this because it was amazing it was incredible the storytelling the world building everything that Morgan Rhodes has written in this is just amazing I have Rebel Spring and Gathering Darkness I am still I think I'm two books behind I thoroughly enjoyed it and I can't wait to read the rest of the series now another one of the series is the selection series I 
just reorganize my bookshelves. I don't really feel like pulling them all out and having to reorganize it again. I just finished the one last night. I have The Heir and The Crown to finish. I know that there are some novellas, but I don't really know the publication order and if I need to read them in publication order. So if you know, please comment down below. Let me know because I do want to get finished with this series by the, hopefully by the end of May or at least by the end of the summer. Another series that I own but haven't finished is going to be the Lunar Chronicles series. I have read Cinder and I was addicted, but for some reason I didn't continue on with the series. And now that I own all of them, I do plan on finishing them by the end of the year because I really want to know what happens. I, I know that in some of the novellas that something pretty big happens and yeah I'm really curious I want to be caught up and know what everybody's talking about so this is another one the Lunar Chronicles series that I really would like to get to and to finish and finally it's one of my favorite series by this author and I had never read anything by this author until last summer and it is going to be the perfect chemistry series there are three Fuentes brothers and each book in the series follows one of the brothers and I have read Perfect Chemistry as well as Rules of Attraction. I know that there is one more and I am, yeah, I am ready to find it and read it because I absolutely, absolutely love Simone Eccles and her writing. It's just, huh. I think I flew through the entire collection that I have by her. I have these two books as well as the Ruined Trilogy and the Return and Leaving Paradise duology by her and I just I loved it I didn't expect to love it as much as I did but I did but yeah those are gonna be the series that I own but haven't finished kind of book talk tag thing but um yeah if there are any of these books that you have read or have started and haven't finished please let me know in the comments below I would be really interested to see what you guys have started and plan on finishing so thank you guys so much for joining me and I hope you have a wonderful day Bye.